of the students. My name is Jiray Kumar from Siddharth uh, Science Technology from CS Department. We will discuss about uh, artificial intelligence. See, uh, generally, uh, first to justify that what is artificial intelligence. Artificial intelligence is a branch of uh, computer science that aims to create intelligence machines. Very simple thing here, artificial intelligence means, so uh, very simple, uh, one thing I will tell you here, here, system can think as a human. System can act as a human. System can, what is that, uh, think as a rationally. System can, act as a rationally. So this is some categories are there in artificial intelligence. The simple uh, just with that here, what is artificial intelligence? Now let us come to the point here. Uh, in this uh, uh, intelligence, uh, we'll discuss about uh, two more uh, uh, some uh, contents are there. Okay, I'll go through it one by one. See, what are the contents are there in our uh, artificial intelligence unit one? Here, uh, uh, first thing is the uh, introduction to artificial intelligence. Introduction of uh, same artificial intelligence uh, and history of uh, artificial intelligence, uh, intelligence systems, uh, foundation of AI, applications of uh, uh, AI, and one real time application we we'll discuss here uh, TikTok by game playing and development of AI languages, and also final. Uh, uh, current trends in AI technologies. So this is about some contents we covered uh, in our uh, unit one uh, syllabus. Okay, let's go through it uh, in our, uh, uh, what is that, uh, induction to AI. So actually, uh, here go through here, the foundational AI was led with the Boolean theory by a mathematician, Bully and other researchers. See, uh, actually, this uh, foundation, uh, a foundation, uh, it will come under uh, uh, one theorem. So let us go here. Actually, in the some past days, uh, actually, some philosophers, okay, they suggested. So, uh, what a suggested means here, system can uh, control by entire universe. So there's some so many philosophers, they are suggested a technology in past days. So that is a here your foundation uh, with Boron 3 one day. Okay. So since the in invention of computer in 1943, AI has been interest to the researchers. Okay. After invention of computer, so our researchers who select as a AI is the uh, one domain. Why you serve this domain means here, I think all of know that computer is a, it is like as one machine only. It is also uh, how it comes here. It is a one, uh, one uh, some some peoples they are integrated with uh, some ideas. Then finally we get the one machine. Okay, so like that A also will be overcome with it. So they always aim to make machines more intelligent than humans. So that that's why nowadays uh, you are using these machines. Okay, AI has grown substantially for the last six uh, six decades, starting from simple to intelligent program. Okay, so that is about uh, uh, work on it here. Then oh, we go with the next point here. AI compromise in numerous subfields uh, ranging from general purpose area to specific task. In this scenario, the first one is the general purpose area. So that is uh, a perceptron, logical reasoning, etc. Okay. And uh, means you know that the general purpose area means this technology you are implemented uh, implementing in some areas so that is uh, like as a perceptron means that uh, using neural networks and also use this one uh, logical reasoning sites okay that is one point here we will be on our next one is a specific task so specific task means here 
very simple thing just say here a uh, specific task means this AI technology especially we are uh, used in a uh, 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 game planes okay and uh, theorem proving on diagonal diseases so many i think so many areas we need to use here so in that uh, game play that's why in our uh, uh, one kind of one play uh, you know content also one thing is there tick tock you know tick tock toy game yes so that very important uh, then you go with next one uh, chess game it's so many games so many games not only one or two here so in this specific task means here, uh, here the, in our universe, so many organizations are there. In those organizations, uh, in, uh, that organization, they maintain one technology. So let us go with a very simple example. I'll tell you here, uh, now a recent example here, Chandrayaan 3. So this Chandrayaan, Ch Chandrayaan 3, uh, entire this system, they are using a technology only. Why? Because at the time of landing, at the time of landing, the entire control by system only, not for human. So that is the best example of AI technology. Means that that is the uh, system can think of own as for, as a, as a human being. Okay, so that's why here is the intelligent than for human, intelligent than human. That's an important thing. Okay, the scientists of other fields uh, use AI to systemize the automate the intellectual task. Yes. He engaged two different significant phase. One, science of a human, intelligent, and uh, engineering discipline. Engineering discipline. So this is about a uh, simple uh, description about uh, AI technology. We have more, lot of things are there in AI technology. We go through it uh, one day, one day, one day. See, next, uh, next time I go with here are uh, possible applications for artificial intelligence. So these are some possible applications are there in our artificial intelligence. Let us come see what are the important things are there. See, this is my uh, in center, it maintain uh, artificial intelligence. Uh, so in this uh, artificial intelligence, we can implement in different areas. So let us come here, IOT. Yes. So in the artificial intelligence, that's why you discuss one Chandra and three recent example. So there you are using this IOT only. Means that here, what does that mean? IOT the sensors. So in this IOT, so many components are there that like as a sensors. By using this sensor to get the information, that's that get the information only. But that information controlled by AIO. Okay, so that is on applications. Okay, these are real time applications. And next one is the image an analytics. What is that? Image analytics. So let us see here uh, for this scenario, image analytics means nothing but here. So let us go with our uh, cricket. In cricket also, uh, we are using this uh, image analytics. Uh, what is that? Means here, so about DRS. So they know that. Okay, DRS is an application. So not only that, let us come to uh, plants, rice plant, uh, any leaf plant. Suppose if any uh, disease occur in this life, and how can you find out that uh, with fertilizer, I have to I have to apply that. So that time you can use this image analytics. So many so many examples are there. I'll, okay, that is the one thing. Next one is the graph analytics. So this also we will implement uh, trading side, uh, cricket. Uh, so many things. Next, uh, audio analytics. Okay, that is a uh, one thing here. Visualization pattern, where visualization, virtual personal assistant. Uh, like uh, nowadays, you are using this uh, uh, more uh, virtual person assistant uh, in, uh, in the place of BPO. Okay, so that is one uh, virtual. Next one is uh, uh, natural language processing. It is also one uh, technology and domain. Also, you can say that here. Next, uh, deep learning is a subset of uh, you know machine learning. Okay. Next one is a uh, simulation modeling. Yes, without uh, hardware components, uh, we will do all experiments in uh, software itself that we call the uh, simulation modeling. So many things, uh, uh, machine translation. Okay, and social network analysis. We can implement this thing in. Uh, uh, let us take simple example, uh, chart GPT. Yes, yes, the best example for in our AI technology. You'll get it at any information using this uh, 
uh, chart GPT. That's the best example I, I can with you guys. And next one is the uh, machine learning. Yes, uh, machine learning also is there. Uh, by integrating with the uh, machine learning and AI, we do uh, miracles. Okay. So that is uh, an example application. Okay. Let us come next one is uh, robotics. Yeah. Uh, and uh, soft robotics. So what is that? robotics means you know that already in uh, so many areas, so many countries already implemented this robotics. Okay. Especially some countries, uh, uh, they already implemented in the place of human being. Uh, so let's say soldiers already implemented there. So now come to the point, uh, some places you already think, uh, some places you've seen there. So in some places, uh, uh, some restaurants, especially some restaurants, uh, they are using these robots because uh, to serve the uh, customers. Okay. So these are some uh, domains as well as so many areas you are utilizing this uh, AI intelligence. Okay. There is a um, possible applications for artificial intelligence okay next uh, here you go with here uh, so many uh, different act, uh, different uh, organizations uh, you are using these ai technologies see 80 80 plus uh, companies uh, secure in the future with the ai they are the uh, future the entire this uh, ai technology they are depending okay Simple thing. So what are there here? One thing is the anti-fraud and the identity management. As nowadays, banking sector required. So for uh, hacking, hacking, so many hackers uh, are there. So that's why you're using this uh, anti-fraud and identity management. Let us come to another one organization, uh, mobile security, for the purpose of mobile security. Okay. We are waiting to use more in our AI implementation of AI. Next one, uh, predictive intelligence. Yes, predictive intelligence side. And if you want to predict anything, now that time use this uh, predictive intelligence uh, means any to reach the target levels, uh, especially weather forecasting. Okay, uh, so many examples and behavioral analytics anomaly detections. So these are the behavioral and anomaly analytics uh, and automated uh, security. There you have so many uh, awaiting the companies here and uh, cyber risk management. Okay and app security, IoT security, uh, description security, so many, so many things. So this is about uh, some startups companies, uh, they are waiting to improve our uh, uh, future in with the AI technology. Yes. And next, uh, you go through with uh, one simple thing uh, in machine learning also. So I here know that the machine learning uh, can be classified into uh, three types. One is a supervisor, unsupervisor, or reinforcement. Okay. So I classify the simple classify that what is supervisor, what is unsupervisor, and what is a reinforcement. Simple, I tell you two lines. Okay. Two or more lines. Let us see. First one is a supervisor machine learning. So especially the first thing that what is the utilization of machine learning means yeah, here to do the automation only. Okay. Uh, but here, when come to the point here, the, the first thing is here, what is a supervisor or uh, unsupervisor reinforcement is here, means here. Here, uh, we have to uh, implement or you have to reach the target level or to detect the target, okay, or class level, anything. So let us come to the point here, super learning. Super learning is here, yes, we can reach the target or you predict the target. Uh, using the class labels, using the class label that it is called a supervisor machine learning. So there, so many applications are there. Again, we have here. They are image classification, identity for detection, customer retention, diagnosis, so many things, especially classification and regression. Okay, there are so many things. Okay, that is the one supervisor learning means that here using these behaviors, uh, class levels only to predict the uh, class levels. Okay, class target. See what is a general example. Let us take one apple. So how can I uh, reach my target is an apple? So see, there based on the behavior. Behavior means here taste, shape. Okay. Uh, some uh, uh, 
color yes or no so based on the behavior only to predict the target that is a supervised machine learning simple term okay then let us come to next one unsupervised machine learning what i mean that unsupervised machine learning means if you go with uh, supervised machine learning enter that environment work with the labels but it's come to unsupervised machine learning it's work with the unlabeled simply so it is also yeah it is also reach the target only but how can reach the target here me means a uh, very simple thing a uh, unlabeled means very simple pattern so that's why here a uh, very uh, example uh, algorithm a method using cluster okay so by applying this cluster uh, uh, patterns you to reach the target levels based on shapes the colors one in one target so that is about uh, unsupervised machine learning another one is a uh, reinforcement machine learning so what i mean the reinforcement machine learning means here see uh, you see here also reach the class level uh, target level only so how could is the target level here reinforcement machine learning means here by experience by experience very simple okay and to get the some reward points also okay that is nothing but here yeah, reinforcement machine learning so very simple example i am taking uh, in this reinforcement reinforcement machine learning so go through it here suppose uh, uh, if you move with any uh, suppose any one uh, restaurants two more restaurants here so how can i give the rating for each restaurant so how can i give each restaurants so when you are uh, uh, by experience only to get uh, uh, some idea about uh, that restaurant then finally to give the some rating to restaurants either a or b or c or the five four three two like that okay that is a experience by experience only to you to get to reach the target level so this is about uh, some uh, machine learning technologies okay so today we'll discuss about uh, what is uh, uh, ai importance of ai and how you will get ai and what are some it like applications of ai okay and where you implement this ai and some uh, little bit uh, you learn some knowledge about machine learning okay thank you to all